Yes, there we go. Right, did I not start? Alright, new game. Let's go. This is where we get off, apparently. Hey, chitty god, no. B3. Isaac Foster. What a stingy elevator. Just take us all the way up instead of trooping us at each fucking door. Here you go. Here you go again. Another elevator on. Yeah. Hey, I'm counting on you. You have the brains on this operation. Make sure we get to the exit. Okay. I'll do everything in my power to make myself useful to you. Just like you swore to God. Once we escape this place, kill me. You sound like a broken record player. Don't gotta tell me again. It's locked. Door's locked. What? I said what? Unbutton your lips. Even if I told you, I'm not sure you wouldn't understand who knows but I won't unless you spit it out it's not unlocked there's something else in this room so it doesn't bode well for us if you don't have a clue then why the hell would I I thought you'd say that <laughs> Oh. Aren't you skilled at unlocking stuff? Good luck with that. For the time being, I'll take another look at the door. Door's locked. I had a feeling it wouldn't open. What are we gonna do? Door's locked. Is there something in my handbag? But this... Hey. Hey, it's still on budge? Nope. You've been eyeballing your bag for a while. What's that about? I thought there'd be something to unlock it. Oh? So what's inside that bag of yours anyway? Um, thread, a needle, and... You don't say. Can you pick up? Can you pick a lock with a needle? I have no idea how to pick locks. Besides, this door has no keyhole. What? <laughs> well, a lot of good some thread and needles gonna do then, huh? Out of my way! I'll smash it open. This door is reinforced with iron bars. Can it? What? Can it? I won't know unless I try. I won't know unless I try, damn it. Yes! Yeah, it's hard as rock. Hard as iron, to be precise. Hey, why didn't you tell me that? Now my hands are numb. I mentioned iron bars. 
Huh? What the fuck? Hey, get back. Bullets. Plan to turn us into Swiss cheese, huh? Sorry, the welcome. Oh, wait, sorry, the welcome party took so long. I guess I sort of dozed off watching your idiotic antics. Still, it's a wonder you survived. <laughs> Especially you, Zach. Bravo to your resourcefulness. Truth be told, I've always had faith that you'd blossom into such a lovely sinner. All this talk about anticipation has my sleepy pe peepers wide awake now. I don't give a flying fuck about your s sleeping habits. Shut the hell up and let us through. Very well, you've earned it. Yep, you've earned it. I am the Condemner. Oh. Go godless wretches. You shall ride in agony until forgiven. For that is my de... 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 devoir? What, what the fuck? No, my... whatever the fuck. Godless wretches. Bullshit. Saying whatever the hell she wants, taking talking like a god herself and shit. Why do I gotta be punished anyway? Oh and my bullshit oh, oh my oh and my bullshit o meter is already pinging off scale and so layout. Is it is already pinging off Paying off scale, so lay off. Okay. Hey, Ray, the door's open. Let's get a move on. Okay. Door's locked. Door's locked. Door is locked. The gate is closed. It's closed. Hey, aren't you listening? When are you supposed to let us through? What's this? I thought you were slow witted, but as it turns out, you're just impatient, hey? I haven't finished putting on my face. I just rolled out of bed after all. I mean, so have I, really. Ugh. Mm. Huh? Well, never mind all that. Sinner, s sinners should receive their punishment in due order, don't you think? I mean, that way it sets the mood for the whole thing, don't you think? I'd better get everything set up. You two should get ready to... to receive your punishment, that is. I left the room in question unlocked for you. Which means... Huh. What's all that supposed to mean? Shall we head to the room for the time being? Is it this one? No. This one. Yes, it's that one. A bored background mugshot is what defines a criminal, right? So, take your mugshot for me. Huh? Mugshot? It's a picture of your mug, Isaac. Never had yours taken before, huh? How lovely. I'll make a half-hearted promise to post it on your fridge. Indeed, the same goes for you as well, Rachel. Show me your photogenic side. Oh, and don't forget to take it while holding a... 
Uh, placard. Pla placard? Ugh, this is such bullshit. Photos of several people are scattered everywhere. <sighs> the people in the photographs are each holding what appears to be a Marshall uh, Picard. There's a camera. Are we supposed to take it with this? Does pushing shutter does pushing the shutter take a photo? Probably fine now. I've never taken the photo or had mine taken. Okay, then should I take mine first? Huh? So, why in the fuck do I gotta get my photo taken for? So you can keep going? Not find the photos? Ah, shit, fine. Okay then, I'll take yours once you're ready, okay? There's a camera. I still can't take it. Why? You don't have a name placard yet. Ugh. All this trouble just for a single photo. The box contains white boards that each have a white string attached. Names are written on the board. They appear to be Marshall placards. Hey, what does say? Our names are written on them. Really? Our names? Well, it's for a mugshot, so I think we need to put these around our necks and take a photo. There's a camera. Should I take yours? Fine. Ugh. <sighs> Hey, if you're not gonna do it, then make it snappy. Stay still. Huh? Like I give a sh Like I give a shit, just take it for crying out loud. It'll come out blurry. For fuck's sake. It's not just some passport photo. Fine, hold still. How would he know about a passport photo? Do I press this? Yeah. This sucks so hard. What do you gotta do this for? Uh, don't push the button too hard. It'll make the camera shake. I knew it. It's blurry. Good enough. Yeah, I think I heard the sound over there. Now I should be able to move on. Is locked. Okay. It's locked. Oh, okay. A series of drawing are scribbled on the wall. Blah. What a piss poor excuse of drawing. Of a drawing. It's like someone smeared shit on the wall. It appears to be a picture of someone sitting on a chair. It appears to be a picture of some sort of green scribble and agonizing face. It appears to be a picture of someone impaled on spikes. It appears to be a picture of a syringe. It appears to be a, a picture of a smiling woman. <laughs> Did you by any chance catch... Did you by any... Did you by chance catch the wall artwork? I've got such wonderful punishments in store for both of you. Isn't that lovely? With drawing skills like that, the only love the only thing lovely will be when they're erased. How cruel. I put my heart and soul into them. But enough about that. More importantly, I'm giving each of you a bit of a choice. Huh? What do you mean? Didn't you know that condemnation comes in a variety of forms? 
how does internal imprisonment strike you? There you can leisurely spend your days productively thinking over your sins. Such tormenting punishment await, awaits you above. However, beyond the iron bars, before you await a lovely new life running away in eternal imprisonment. So what do you say? Who the fuck is there? Who the fuck in their right head would want to do something like that? Too bad. All I wanted was to keep you for the rest of your lives. The offer still stands if you change your mind. What? You think I'm just gonna sign my life over like some fucking dumbass? Eternal imprisonment. Death will not be swift, I take it. Hey. Don't even give this bitch so long of... Lo don't even give this bitch the time of day. Act like she doesn't exist. Let's keep going. I'm just going to save. Path continues beyond the bars. Is this the first punishment room? Even if it is, we've got no choice but to keep going. The door's been locked. Huh? Does everyone around here get sort of sick? Some sort of sick door fetish or something? Come on. There's so many chairs. What's sitting in the ch What's sitting in the chairs? People? Dolls? And that chair in the center. Huh? Yet another piece that makes no freaking sense. Ah, wait. Dolls sitting so it faces the chair in the center of the room. So they're all dolls, huh? So it seems. At any rate, you're thinking about how to get through here. Okay. Just to be safe, you should take a look around too. Will do. There's a chair strapped with cords and restraining device. Something smells like burning. It appears to be some sort of machines. machine, but it isn't functioning. There's nothing inside. Rags and cleaning things are strewn about. Fire the rag. Nice. There's nothing inside. Nothing inside. Find anything worth mentioning? There is a door on the other side, but a wall's blocking the way. And you didn't smash it because. Huh? Listen, punk, this wall's made of iron, and I can't smash it. Oh. Aren't you the one who said that iron bars can't be destroyed? I was... Honestly, I was expecting that you would ignore that and try to smash it anyway. This room looks like it might be hiding something, but everything seems to be fixated with no sign of budging. All the dolls appear motionless too. Maybe I'll let Zack know. He's not gonna be happy, he'll... He's not gonna be happy. He'll get over it though. You find something? Uh... Um? Did you even look? Uh... Um... So, no clue about a way out, huh? Yeah, about that. Damn!
Zaku. Hey, are you sure there's nothing? Not sure, but what do I know is... But what I do know is I've yet to find any kind of clue. Quit messing with me. If there's nothing here, then how about I start smashing everything? Wouldn't that be faster? There's no evidence suggesting so. Huh? No evidence? There's no evidence to say I can't smash. Mind holding that thought for a bit? Oh man, I'm pissed. No way forward and no way back. Man, this shit's so fucking tiring. Hey, I wouldn't sit on that chair if I were you. Huh? Put a sock on it, I'm so out of it. I'd get out of that chair if I were you. What's the big deal? You couldn't find anything around here, right? But that chair... Huh? What about this chair? Is probably for execution. An electric chair. Ah. Duh. What the fuck? Hey, don't just stand and do something. Okay, hang on a second. Greetings. My apologies, I can't be there in person. I condemn the guilty on the- I condemn the guilty on this floor. Don't forget it. I'll be the last thing you ever see. Well, my sinful duel. Duo. Are you enjoying yourselves? Oh goodness. Zack sat in that chair, hey? Shit. Hey, bitch, get me out of this thing. Surely you just... I'm afraid that I won't... I'm afraid that won't just happen. What kind of an executioner sets their conviction... Their, con their, their convicts free? Oh my god. Zack, my boy. I get giddy at the thought of seeing how well a monster like you can withstand my punishment. Why, Zack? What could be the matter? It hurts, you bitch! Incredible. Your lives are so strong. A wonderful murdering monster. Oh, you're the perfect specimen of a sinner. Shut the fuck up! Get this thing off me so I can wipe that fucked up smile off your face. Rawr. Well... I'll leave the electric chair on so lots of lovely bolts continue to curse, course through your body. In the meantime, Rachel Godna can find a way to deactivate it. If you're lucky then who knows, I might even let you both through here. Stop it. You won't survive. Oh, well hello my child. Does it not captivate you to learn how much of a tenacious monster of a sinner that Zack is? Besides, do you think a sinner has any say in this? Well then, let the punishment begin! Ladies and gentlemen! Relish the despicable sinner's writhing in agony! Hey, Ray! You know what you gotta do, right? You gotta do this or you won't be holding up your end of the bargain. Don't screw up. Pu prove yourself useful to me. But let me murder this sadistic crazy bitch. Mm. 
Okay, I'll do what I can. The loathing grace of grace, the loathing gaze of the audience upon the sinner. A gaze is the virtue of the sinner's demise. Here, the eyes of the spectators can exact the punishment. Right, I remember what you have to do. Now, let the fun begin! Eyes of the spectators? Does that mean these dolls are the, are the spectators? Hmm, what to do? It's electrified. Getting too close is dangerous. Dolls are sitting on its... Uh, so it faces the chair in the center of the room. There's nothing inside. The doll sits silently without staring. It appears as, as if its head is slumped. This doll isn't moving. Its head is slumped. Does it not want to face forward? Turn it backwards. Yeah, hurry up. I will. Okay, well this is different from the anime, because doesn't she just take Zack's scythe and like starts... Hurry your ass up! I'll do my best. Is the current weakening? I'll check it out. I feel like the electrical current has slightly weakened. Zack, how is it? How's what? Still got a ways to go. Maybe I need to have more dolls up the way. Uh, ow! Hang in there. Wait. The chair and the doll's body are secured and unmovable. The doll's head looks looks like it could be turned backwards. You know what happens if I die, don't you? If you die, then it's hopeless for me. I can't let that happen. Let's head backwards. Kill you, I'll kill you, I'll kill you, I'll kill you. Kill who? Shut up, don't answer me now. Hurry up and save me. electric current is weakening. How do I make the rest of those look away from the electric chair? Uh, if I can just get the doll's heads to move. I'm gonna think, doesn't Zack have a scythe? Oh, so she does use Zack's scythe. Is that any better, Zack? Are you fucking with me? Hey, can you throw your scythe to me? Ha! Right here, I need it for something. Damn you. There, now do something. Shit! I can't reach. I can't move. The rest is up to you. You can be as loud as you want. Talk to me if you're still alive. Man, you're selfish. Don't you know I'm dying over here? That's in there, you're okay. Can't reach the side. Be thankful I threw it at all because that's the last favor I'm doing. Zack's scythe is on the other side of the iron bars. It's hot. I can't touch it directly. Rag. If I grip with this rag. 
required Zack Scythe. Now this is heavy. Wow, this is heavy. Probably won't be making any clean slashes like that. I'll do what I can. Cut off the head. Stopped. Is Zack okay? The iron bars are unlocked. Zack, are you okay? Zack? Oi. What the hell took you so long? A little longer and... And the drop of piss could have powered the world for 1,000 fucking years. So you're alive. Ding, ding, ding. What do we have here? What do we have for her, Johnny? Thank goodness. I wouldn't know what to do if you died. Stupid. As if I'd die so easy. Incredible. Simply incredible. He survived. I knew it. It's the resilience of murderous monsters that make them so alluring. Oh, what an exemplary and perfect specimen you are, Zack. To tell the truth, I'd hope to witness the very moment that life leaves your body. Seeing her work so hard to convince me to be nice this time, you may pass through. Besides, punishment, one's, punishment for one's sins is not a one-time thing. One must be punished. As for many sins committed, isn't that lovely? <laughs> Sadistic bitch. That stupid-ass chuckle of hers pisses me off. If you weren't hiding behind that monitor, I'd have, I'd have sliced you up good. Hmm? Hmm. Hey, give me that back. Okay. What the? What the fuck is this? There's some kind of junk all over it. I used it to cut the heads off the dolls. What are you? What are you? Some sort of doll killing psychopath? The hell were you doing? It seems the mechanism had to do with the doll's gaze, so I made them face away from you. Use my f scythe for some weird shit and I turn into an electric heel? It's just one thing, one damn thing after another. It's half your own fault. Shut it! It's you who needs to be more careful. Let's get going. Cool. It's a door that says extreme caution. Hey, what the hell are you doing? Doors are made to be walked through. It looks dangerous. I'm not gonna get anywhere if you chicken shit. I think we need to be more uh, careful considering what happened earlier. The inside of the window is dirty and not visible. There's some sort of scratch marks. Door is locked. It's locked. 
Hey, open up. There's no response. Shit. It's that woman. She's probably spying on us through. She's probably spying on us right now. So, Zach. How much do you know about this building? Huh? Didn't you ask the same thing before? I did, but the people in this building... I was wondering how much you knew about them. Huh? The guys here? All I know is they're creepy as fuck. Really? I never really hung around the floors in the... F I hung around the other floors in the, floors in the, f in the first place. Except for moving between floors. Surely they show themselves to me once in the blue moon. But they're all fucking crazy. Not the kind you have a chit chat with. Crazy. So did you ever get the urge to kill them? Ha. Ah. Never mind. Okay, let's look elsewhere. Looks like it's the only way to go. I greatly fear for our safety. There's no freaking point to worry about that bullshit now, is there? Hey, I'm talking to you. Zuck. You should consider what I'm saying. What the hell is up with you? I mean... Alright, let's save. No, I wanted to... Can I please save? Cool. Go through. I suspected as much. Shit. Well, it doesn't surprise me anymore that it would be locked. A machine that says gate access looks like it takes card type key. There are scratch marks made by something on the wall. The wall is cracked with dirt. A cluster of televisions installed on the wall. There's something here. A key is on the desk. Required safe key. The box is tightly shut, it has no keyhole, and appears to have some sort of lock mechanism. There's a pair of scales. The safe is locked. But I have the key! The key is not meant for here. Oh, never mind. If it's not meant for here, then there's no point messing around with it. A dark red stained human shaped object lies on there. Lies there. Something's written on the floor. Men with unsightly legs. The men who lay here are spineless murderous fools. Who try to laugh with their own feet. <sighs> Rather than agonize for admitting one sin, simply abandon those legs. Though even that proves futile. In the end, both those feet are merely used by foolish sinners to aimlessly wander hell for all eternity. The door is wrapped and shut tight. There's some- Oh, there's nothing inside it. Oh, damn it. I got my hopes up. There are everyday items inside. Scratch marks continue to the top of the wall. There's a shabby mattress. Nothing inside the box. Nothing inside the box. Nothing inside the box. The safe is locked, but I have the key. The safe is unlocked. Let's look. 
Save contained. Uh, the save contained what appears to be a single remote control. Hopefully, yeah, this should probably hurt that, but oh well. Acquired remote control. A remote control. Hey, is that all? Uh huh. What the hell? This safe's as big as me, and that's all that was in there? A big ass safe with nothing worthwhile inside? It's like oversized garbage from hell. Oh, wait, wait, the TVs. There we go. How's everyone doing? This is a video for all you sinners out there. Allow me to cue. Uh, allow me to clue you as in what, what is going on. The death trap in this room is designed with an extravagant twist. It features an airtight interior to ensure no air leaks outside. Naturally, the room comes completely with re reinforced glass windows. Go on, just try to break them. Permeating the interior is something wonderful indeed. This lovely feature will also greatly coat the sinner's lungs in toxic death. Have you guessed it yet? That's right, deluxe poison gas. Oh yes, that's not to say there isn't a means of escape. Out of the mercy of my heart, I've prepared not two, but one shoddy gas mask. But it's so old, it could crumble away in your hands at any moment. Good luck escaping before your mask breaks, filling your poor pair of lungs with toxic poison. Have fun and be sure to breathe sparingly. Don't take it personally. Run away, run away convict and alluring sinner. Just be sure to go ahead and let the gas do its job. If you fail to dazzle me, okay? <laughs> I almost forgot. Should you bore me by taking too long to meet your uh too long to meet your maker, keep in mind there's a time limit. Go over the time limit and there's an extra special gift in store for you. Extra potent super deluxe poison gas. Check the TV to keep tabs on the time limit, okay? Alright, in just a few seconds. It'll be time to unleash the gas. Hope you have a fantastic time. <sighs> Sorry, wake, waking up makes me tired. Hey, what's the plan? Her explanation said there's a way to escape. I'll do everything in my power to find out how to escape. At any rate... Let's hurry up and put on the gas mask. Hey, I gotta put this on. Yeah, the cord makes it so it can't be moved from from here. However, it's searching. However, whoever is searching the room can use it. So, go ahead and use it for now. Gotcha. But what happens if you die? We'll find out. We'll find out. Cut the crap. If you die, then I'll be stuck here. Figure it out. Okay, how's this? I'll go take a look around for a bit. Then come switch plate. Then come switch places with you. Fine. Better than you dying on me. Scratch marks. Yeah. But the mark marks are, are too high to see what. Where they go? 
that tight. There's nothing inside. There's nothing on top of the shelf, but it's out of reach. This might be of use. Required scissors. Was there anything we could do with scissors? All that's left is on the top shelf, but it's out of reach. It is locked. Scratch marks made by something on the wall. There's nothing around that looks like we can cut with scissors. Oh. That's cool. Move it. It's heavy stuck to the floor and too much for me to move on my own. Take a look at it. A message is written on the floor next to what? Resembling an index finger. Huh? Uh... Is it some sort of execution sequence? Left, down, right, down... Right down. Um. Talk. Hurry up. This mess getting on my nerves. It's hard to talk and reeks of dust. So make a point not to talk to me. Got it? Nothing inside the box. Those shabby matches. I can see something deep inside the incision, but I can't, can't reach it. I can probably reach it if I make. Uh. If I make more incisions. I'll try cutting this match just with these scissors. I found the key in the mattress. Fire the key. Go for a small key. Mm, this key is not meant for here. This. Hmm, this key is not meant for here. Um... What is it meant for then? Safe? Wire was inside the safe. Acquired wire. Now that I think about it, isn't that red box the same that you find in Pocket Mirror? Like where the... Where like the Jack in the Box are? I swear that is it. That is the exact same box. It's probably just a generic RPG Maker asset, but still. What can I use this for? The gas is wearing... The gas is wearing on me. And I'm stuck anyways. Maybe I can ask him to take over searching for a bit. Trade place. Zack. Oh? What? I checked around. But there's a place out of my reach. And somewhere that requires two, uh... Requires more force than I'm capable of. Oh, and? Hey, how can I know unless you, unless you tell me? Don't make me repeat myself. The poison gas is making me woozy. I want to trade places. Huh? Why didn't you tell me that? We're already on a crunch, we're already on a crunch for time. If you die, I'll never get out of here. Yeah. Okay, so I just gotta check out the places that you couldn't, huh? Yeah. Gotcha. Now you stay here and breathe like there's no tomorrow. Ho? Oh? There's something up there. <laughs> Shit. I can't reach it. Fuck. Um... Those shots I won't open. It won't budge. I'll tell you what to put it, I'll smash it until it opens. There's nothing inside. So she wants me to get what's on top of this shelf. And she can't reach this high? <laughs> Probably can't ride on a roller coaster either. 
required bag of weights. Huh? All that's in the bag is a lump of iron. Oh, maybe I've got it. Yeah, I want this thing break. All right, break, break, break. Hurry up and break already. <laughs> Look, I told you it's the quickest way to get shit done. What's inside? A cleaning brush was inside. Fired brush. What the fuck? Man, I feel like an idiot. All that for some piece of, from some piece of shit brush. There are everyday items inside. Huh? There ain't nothing worth anything. Oh. Is that thing on top of the shovel she was talking about? Fired poker. Box is tightly shot. It has no keyhole. Dark red stain humans. Is this a corpse? Take a look at it. Fuck, as much as I want to sit and look at a dead guy. Hold it, he's written something. I don't get it. If you're gonna leave a clue, then try to do a better job, even if it kills you, damn it. Move it. Oh man, it's nothing. Plus, the damn light came off. Hmm? No. It didn't come off. It was already se severed. Oh well. Guess I'll take the leg, this leg to her. Fired leg. I'm gonna heave. What's wrong with me? I feel sick. Am I stressed out? My body's totally fucked. Nothing's making any sense. Guess I'll turn back. Hey, what? I have no idea what I gotta do next. I see, then switch places with me. Okay, I'm counting on you. I'll pass you what I found. There's just useless, useless objects to me, so find a way to use them. A poker, iron weight, and brush. A leg. The hell's a brush good for? Never mind the brush. Are you bitching to me? What do you want me to do? Spin gold from straw or something? I, uh, do what I can. Door's destroyed. There's no longer anything inside. And not, not need to do that. Um, brush. Sit in the place for cleaning. Wire. Such a fine wire. Poker. What can I use this for? The walls caked with dirt. I wonder if there's something I can get rid of this dirt. That's what the brush is for. The brush is now stained dark red. A stained free wall has writing carved into it. Acknowledge thy sin and sever the part which hath commit committed it. Rest it along with the height of thy sin on the scales. Yet, should it be gray as thy soul, thy desire shall come to pass. I gotta match up the amount of sin with the weight on the scales. Bag of weights. It's pretty heavy. First I gotta place the weight on my sin of the scale. Uh, my weight... That... Well, the handbag. Then put the weight on the other. 
No good. The scales aren't balanced. There's a pair of scales. Place the weight of my sin on the scale. The leg? Then put the weight on the other. Yes. The box opened. There's an old battery powered lantern inside. Looks like it has no batteries. Is there somewhere else to look for some? Can't think of anywhere else. You probably say you won't know unless you tell me. But Zach, I wonder if he'll give me some advice. Talk. Ah, what? Can you breathe in that mask? For fuck's sake, can you tell? Can you, can't you tell that by looking at me? If I couldn't, I would be here. I wouldn't be here talking to you, duh. Consult. What's that? Huh? What is it? Did you find a way out? Uh. Ha! Hurry up! Okay. Then what do you want? You want to switch places again? Um, I got a question for you. Huh? What is it? Spit it out. I, uh, don't really know where to look anymore. Do you have any ideas for places that might turn up something? Oh. Me. Places that might turn up something? Yeah. If you can't find it, then what the hell makes you think I can- Wait, I know a place. Where? High up in the wall, there's some kind of dugout space. But even I prop but even if I prop up on a box on its side and starting to turn it and stand on it. Oh my god. But even if I prop up a box on its side and stand on it, I can't reach it, so there's no way you could. I see. We're screwed. Hey Ray, follow me there. But what about the mask? It hasn't worked for a while now, it's probably busted, so we don't need it. Zuck. There you are. Okay, here we go. Huh? Oh, sometimes a little toss is all you need. Hey, quit spacing out and go check it out. Okay. There's a hole. You might be able to pass through here, but it's dark. Pretty sure if I had a battery powered lantern, but no batteries. Wonder if I can make do with something I have. Wire? Crap, it's no use. Um. Poker? Rush? Um... Black card, no. Remote control? Oh, the remote. It should have batteries in it. I... How did I not think of that? Even I don't know. Now the lantern will work. Enter it. What a tight squeeze. I can keep going, but I'll be facing the other way when I go back. Oh. I guess go right. Keep going, keep going. It's a dead end. Gotta go back. Go left. Keep going. Keep going. There's a hole. There's something deep inside. But it's out of reach. Didn't I have a poker? Alright, this will do. I caught something. But I can't pull it out. Can it only turn a certain way when I move it? Maybe this hole is a key in itself. Which way should I turn it? Right. Doesn't work. Start over. I'll stick the poker inside. Let me turn a certain way. Left. Up. Start over. Left. 
down, right, up, fuck. Oh! Oh, it's the the thing that the motherfucker was... Okay, yeah, no, 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 no. It's the drawing on the body, hold on. Left, down, right, down, right, down. Got it. A key emerged from the hall. Acquired car key. I put this into the machine at the exit, then I'm sure. I gotta hurry back. All we gotta do is put that into the machine by the exit, right? Yeah, I think so. Okay, then let's do this. Okay. Hey, what's wrong? My vision's getting blurry. Huh? Shit. The poison's in our system. Give me the card. I just need to put it in, right? Yes, if you would. Hey, move it. Follow me. Should I pop this? I should pop this in here, right? Yeah. Huh? It won't go in. Ah, oh, why won't it go in? Huh? The card's fucking bent. <laughs> Get out of town. The thing that you yourself would cause the game to end. Silly Zach, you inserted it the wrong way. I'm laughing so hard I could die. Please do die. How about a little help here? We've come this far, so you do us a solid. Just do us a solid here. Open it. I certainly haven't exacted enough punishment yet. Sinners have to follow the rules, right? Well, it looks like they'll be getting a compulsory game over. I'm afraid that there's no choice but to shower you with even more potent poison gas. Did you know that poison gas costs a pretty penny? You spoiled sinners, you had... You spoiled sinners, you. Ho, ho, ho. Toodles, have fun writhing in agony. You fucking bitch. Suck. What? You won't... You won't keep the promise we made unless we get out of here, right? Ah, uh, can we talk about that later? Answer me. That's right. The minimum requirement is me getting out of life, so what? Okay. I'll do everything I can then. But I'm not sure if it'll work. Is that okay with you? We're as good as dead anyways, so what so do what you want so do what you can. And this game is linear, it really doesn't need multiple saves. This gas might be flammable. I think I'd be able to create an explosion if I stagger in, uh, if I stagger ignite the, the gas. I need batteries. Remote control. That's not it. I need batteries. I'll take the batteries from the lantern. Next, by connecting these batteries, I can attach, I can attach uh, an object that conducts heat. Um, the what? The wire. Then I'll coil the object to be ignited by that heat with wire. I don't. The remote control? That's not it. Uh, poker? Scissors? Uh, rag? Okay. Zach, put this, uh, put on this room's, put this on this room's exit. Be careful not to break it. Like this? Yeah. 
If this catches fire, then it'll probably explode. What the? What do you mean? But I don't fancy blowing up. That's why we need to find a place to take cover. Good work finding a place like that here. I know of one. There's a bit of a tight squeeze, though. Even a big husky built guy like you could probably fit. Straight into these, those just need to uh, fit into in, fit into there, right? Too bad. Gas execution complete. Uh, okay, I could barely move, but eh. it's fine. I'll just do it over again. No, need batteries. Uh, wire. Uh, rag. Is this where we hide? So it's destroyed. There's no longer anything inside. Shit. There we go. Kaboom. Oh my god. Shit, it's hot. I'm getting out. You freaking serious? Hey, good to see you alive. The exit's open now. Then let's get the hell out of here. We finally made it out of that shitty room. Huh. I'd be surprised if that bitch had any idea that would ever happen. <laughs> hey, hang in there. Okay. Did I do good? Fuck, girl. You blew up the entire place to freaking kingdom come, do you know? You sure show there. I see. Hey. We made it this far, so don't go dying on me. Alright, I'm fine. What are you saying? That look on your face says otherwise. I'm fine, don't worry about me. Hmm? <sighs> Alright, let's get moving. I can't have you dying on me, but we gotta keep going. I know I'm fine. I can walk. Doors unlocked. I'm a little surprised you got out of that predicament. <laughs> Incredible. I hate to admit it, but you deserve props. As a bonus, I've opened up the door. Hehe. <laughs> that was the deal from the start, duh. Stupid belittling bit. Belittling bitch. Hey. There's no telling what's beyond here, so try to stay close. I'll do what I can. Uh. Hello, Ever. Or. I don't know what to call you. Should I call you, like, Ever? Master? Mimic? Can you not walk any faster? Hey. I'm fine. Oh man, we're never gonna get anywhere at this place. At this pace. Keep going. I'd like- I'd like to if possible. But I'd just get stuck somewhere if I went by myself. It's okay. I can walk. 
You sure you won't pass out and die on me? I'll do my best. What do you mean, do your best? If you die, that won't mean shit. Sure, death is your wish and all. But what about mine? It won't be granted if you kick the bucket. Yeah, you're right. And then... Okay, then I need to do even better from now on. Man, you're bright. Though you always just repeat yourself like some sort of pull string doll. What should we do? Just shut up while you're ahead. You're human, right? Think for yourself. If you can wait for a bit, the dizziness should go away. Oh, hey. The cameras can't see us here. I'll wait here, so hurry up. Okay. Man, she looks like a... Uh, man, she... Man, she looks ghost white and even more doll-like when she's asleep. It's nice to see... It's not... Uh, it's nice that she does what she's told. But I'm always answering with a yeah or yes. Is she a... Always... Oh wait, she's always answering with a yeah or yes. Is she a robot? How dull. I'm just wondering why I'm getting so bent out of shape over all this. Ah, could it be the poison from earlier? Could the poison from earlier be in my system too? There's no use in thinking of pointless shit like this. I'll also take it easy for a bit. Oh. Hey. You know that kid that got here this month? I smelled something foul, so I went to check it out. But he's dead as a but he's dead as a doorknob. Oh, is that right? Uh, so, what do we do about it? Bury it in the yard. Again? You sure that's okay? Nobody's gonna come looking for a kid they dumped off here for chicken feed. But I can't stand it. Touching something decomposed is gross. Listen to how selfish you sound. Ah, uh, that reminds me. Is that other kid still alive? That kid, the one that looks like a disfigured monster with burns. Oh, him? Yep, still alive and kicking. Nobody's been feeding him either. Must be foraging for scraps or something. The whole thing makes my skin crawl, to be frank. Hey, we should just let him bury the dead kid. Let one kid take care of the other. That's an option. I tried him once before. Uh, he just went sent. He just silently buried the body. Oh, really? It's perfect, right? The less scraps that are left, the less the garbage stinks. Plus, we're short-handed. Who'd have thought keeping a monster alive would be so handy? It's like a tool of sorts. A role befitting of a monster as it were. Yeah, sounds good to me. We'll consider our problem solved. It's a movie time for me. And don't give me the health and don't give me health of it for it this time. Gross. It's that splatter horror flick that you're obsessed with, right? I'm in love with that movie. That scene where those upbeat morons get slaughtered always gives me a kick. You're sick, you know that? Can't stand the movie. 
can't stand that movie. The killer doesn't even die at the end. Seriously. And please don't watch that. Didn't you leave the house with it playing the other day? I'm gonna watch it whether you like it or not. Now go have him take care of that corpse. Zack. Zack. Ha. You up? Zack. Can you walk? Yeah, I'm fine. I feel quite refreshed, actually. In that case, let's get a move on. Because of you, I saw something sickening. Hey, since you're here, I thought I'd extend my offer once more. Are you sure eternal imprisonment doesn't strike your fancy? I told you, I'm sure as fucking rain. Get off my back about it, you bitch. Quit acting like some paradise or something. I know very well what kind of miserable existence you're offering, so back off. Aw, no takers. You don't wish to play things for my enjoyment? Ha! Huh? I'm referring to you when I say play things. I mean, seeing the both of you together just is just comical. You made some odd promise of each other, no? Precarious promises. Which are mere acts of- <laughs> Oh god. I'm tired. <laughs> per uh, precarious promises, which are m more acts of pushing your selfish agendas upon one another. While it appears you have mutual interests on the surface, it actually... In actuality, you are merely playing one another. But the question is... Who is really playing whom? Huh? What do you mean by that? I used to play Angels of Death a long time ago. Oh, nice. Did you know that apparently there's like a game like that for like for there's like an Eddie game for some reason. I don't know why Eddie of all characters got like a game like a spin-off. But I'm gonna be playing that like when I finish this. Yeah. I also love the anime. Oh, listen to me prattle on. Not getting through, am I? Of course I'm not. You're sinners for a reason. Such typical sinners. I love it. Oh, and that foolish girl is quite a cutie, isn't she, Zach? But I don't play it anymore? I mean, fair. It probably it's probably like finished right there's probably nothing that uh that is left or well aside from that edgy spin-off that i'm not really sure of well, let me yeah angels of death episode eddie i am very curious as to why this game even exists Such typical sinners, I love it. Oh, and the foolish girl is quite a cutie, isn't she, Zach? Uh, well, I hope you continue having fun getting punished. <laughs> it's you who's stupid. Play things. Damn. I feel like I'm gonna puke. Zach? Don't talk to me right now, let's go. Path continues beyond the bars. I wonder if this leads to the very first fork in the path. What's wrong? I think I heard some sort of voice. Hmm. 
Yeah, especially because, like, this game is, like, linear, unlike many other RPG Maker horror games that usually have multiple endings. I think this always leads to, like, the same outcome. Which, I mean, is perfect for an anime adaptation, but, yeah. Uh... The Raxies of the Jail Room are dark and not visible. Re... 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 Rhesus? I don't know what that word is. A foul stench permeates the air. Oh, hello, sir. How's your day? I'm doing good. How are you? Oops. Uh, not visible. Smells like something is rotten. Okay. Uh, hello, cyber boy. How you doing? Hey, what gives? Voices. Again. Huh? What's wrong? Something resembling a human hand is moving. A hand? Same as yours. A nice and lovely day. Oh, that's good. One of the bitches, uh, prison victims, huh? It's such a shitty shape that it, that its body crumbles just by stepping on it. This happened because he chose the eternal imprisonment offer that bitch mentioned. This guy is more worthless than tits on a fucking bull. Looks like there's people even dumber than me. Hey, don't mess with it. It's already dead. It's not alive. Huh? You think? Let's get out of here. We've wasted enough time on this bullshit. Okay. No, something is wrong. Right so played Angels of Death, but not anymore because I deleted it on my uh, deleted on my new vid. Oh. Can you not use swearing words? Yeah, you're on the wrong channel. <laughs> I mean, especially because I did, especially because like, how am I not, how am I supposed to not say it's literally in the game's text? It's dark and bare, it's dark and barely visible, but the floor looks deadly. Greetings. Welcome, kids. Congratulations on making it this far. As you can see, make one wrong step and you'll fall uh, to your spiky demise. <laughs> but it's actually not as bad as I make it out to be. There are just two paths. Yep. The path for each just winds up in a slightly different place. That's all. Uh, which path you take is entirely up to you. Well, punishment awaits beyond here as well, though, right? Anyway, which will it be? Well, there are two of you, after all. Isn't it about time to end the silly charade? You and your childish, pro childish promises. It's almost laughable. I think it's an unfair promise, considering you will die anyway. Well, enough about that. In this... Uh, in this room anyways, the both of you, uh, won't be taking the same path. <laughs> Best of luck. I'm waiting to see who gets condemned first. Shit. Why she's gotta make everything so tedious? When the hell can I get out of here? Uh, I gotta keep my cool. That stupid cackling beat. Uh, that stupid cackling bitch. I want to. I want to chop her to bits so badly. Hey, what are you still spacing out for? After I take care of that woman, be sure to kill me too once you're out. Um. Can, can you tell the? Can you tell me the name of this game, please, sir? Uh, it's uh, Angels of Death. It's uh, it's about uh. See the currently playing right here. Yeah. It's, 
Yeah, that's that's the uh, name of the game. It's uh, Angels of Death. Yeah, might be hard to notice though, cause it's kind of up, it's just kind of up there. But yeah, yeah. It, has a, it actually has a it has an anime adaptation too. Like it got an anime like a couple years ago. Um. Fuck, man, you got a one-track mind. You don't seem willing to kill me, after all. It's because that vacant look of yours. What games did you play? Um, On this Endurance stream, I played Valhalla, the bartender game. I played... Uh, I played Ebe, that I still need to finish. Uh, I played Coffin of Ashes. Uh, or I finished Coffin of Ashes permanently. Don't need to touch it anymore. Uh, what did I play again? Uh, I played Inmost, right. I played Misao. I got the last ending in Madfather. And yeah, that's pretty much everything I played. And everything else you can just... Like, everything outside of this stream, you can just go back on my channel and see what I played. It's because the vacant look of yours. Oh, and my promise with you. It's not good until after we're at, we're out of here. Angels of Death, huh? Okay, sir, I'm just go get it uh, after the stream. Thanks, sir. Not a problem. I'm aware. As a spinoff, too. Do something about that vacant doll face stare of yours in the meantime. And while you're at it, stop asking me stupid shit and go... Stop asking me stupid shit. Got it? But... A promise, a promise. Quit, quit ordering me around so much. Okay, I'm sorry. Let's get going. Hey, what's the matter? This rope bridge could snap at any moment. I'm not sure if it's sturdy enough for me, let alone for the both of us. Huh? There's no point unless we both get going. Uh, if we both get out of here. Damn. How about we look elsewhere? Okay. The passage continues on the other side. Looks like we can make it if we jump. Jump? That far? I'll never make it. Ah, shit. Alright. Want me to chuck you over then? Can you repeat me? Can you repeatedly fling me over to the other side? Repeatedly? What? Oh. Well, if I screwed up, then you'll fall head first. Flinging you is a... Is a... Fuck is that word? Flinging you is a... Kinch? What a... I don't know. Uh, the problem is, I can't control how hard I throw you. Is that... In that case, that's not... Hey, what's the plan? We're getting nowhere fast. We have no choice but to split up. Huh? Will we make it if we do that? I'm not sure. Not sure? What the hell happens if we die? What happens? Ah, fine. Sorry for asking something so dumb. Let's Let's move. Oh wait, I see on Kara when she was playing Omori. Yeah. I thought you came from I, I thought you found me from there. I'd barely make it across. A gun? I've I've got no choice but to cross and make sure not to get shot. I got shot. <laughs> okay, well. That's fine, that's fine. I better make it across a gun. I should have run, now that I think about it. No, I just saw your name 
in chat, so I just sub to your chat. Oh. I mean, yeah, that's kind of what I assumed. Uh. There we go. This wasn't that bad. I somehow made it through. Zack. What is this? Zack and I are shown on the screen. Oh, okay. Hey, another gun? Hope she's not getting any ideas about getting herself killed. Ah, oh, man, there's no point in thinking about this bullshit. So I just gotta jump over the floor and cross to the other side, huh? What the hell? Which way do I jump? Ah, shit. Yeah, I'll get out of there if I improvise. It's a little far. Shit, I can't jump that far. Damn, which way do I go? Go back, duck. Huh? Why? I can see you on the screen over there. Over here. Zack, jump in the direction I tell you so you can pass through safely. Zack? I heard you the first time. All I need to do is go back, right? Yes. If you proceed as, this, as I say. Knock it off. I think I can get back on my own. If you say so. Oh, am I con- Yeah, I'm controlling Zack. Okay, I gotta go back. Lower right. Zack, take the lower right. I'll turn back, so quick barking out orders, you hear? Uh, I used to be good at other games. Ooh, nice. As I suspected, this way is a dead end. Yep. <laughs> ah, shit. Lower right. Lower right. Uh. Low down. Uh. Left. Lower left. Down. Down. Zach, you were supposed to keep. I'm trying to. Zach. When you get back, take four paces to the left and jump to the floor above. I don't remember this in the anime. Hold up. Let me take a picture of that because I will never remember that if my life depends on it. Um. Okay. Zack? Yeah, yeah. So I go here. From here, jump to the upper left. Then jump up from there. The only way to go is up, duh. Spare me the details. I can see you on the screen, so I thought it would be quicker for me to tell you. That, and if you don't make it across, it'll sort of be worse. I'm not some pawn in a game for chess. Quit treating me like one. It's a good idea? Yeah. Up. Up. Upright. Well, that was simple. <laughs> Yo. What's up? There's two different doors, one here and one over there. So it would seem. What's the plan? Other than to keep going, I'm not entirely sure. You sure you, uh, you sure you still ain't got any poison in your system? Your face looks spaced out. I'm fine now. Okay, I guess I didn't need a picture of this. Uh. Well, 
I guess all we can do is keep going. Yeah, I know. I'll do what I can. Duh. Do you want me to kill you? He's pissed. Uh, the nature is so disgusting. I'm going to go back inside. Oh, uh, we're touching grass. <laughs> Gamers are weak to grass. Is room beyond the iron bars where Zack went? There he is. Zack, this room. The door is locked, and all there is is the syringe. So what the hell are we supposed to do now? Shoot up and get high? A syringe, hey? I'll go check it out. It's a syringe filled with something. The needle is sharp and appears to be the, the real deal. What kind of drug is this? <laughs> Hello, we finally get to meet in person. Cassidy Bob. My goodness, both of you are here. That's more than I planned for, but I've got a feeling we're in for a treat. You sadistic bitch. What the fuck is... Is it this time? Oh, Zack. Why so hostile? Is that the way you talk to a beautiful lady? Some things never change. But that's also what makes me so hot for you. Zip it. How about you come down here so I can slice you up good? Silly boy. You're the one to meet your demise. Hey, what's your plan this time? Hey, Rachel Gardner. What do you think a syringe is for? To inject medicine into the body? Bingo! The door in this room will unlock when each of you inject those syringes. One contains a healthy dose of vitamins, while the other has a not so healthy dose of something else. The something else has a potent chemical capable of lulling you to sleep and tormenting you with nightmares. Goodness, you may not even wake up. What? Which syringe is it? As if I'd tell you. As if I'd tell. I forgot anyway. Originally, this room was designed so someone would have to make the right or wrong choice. You saw how the path worked in the room earlier, right? If luck is on your side, you'll inject the vitamins. You inject the vitamins, otherwise you inject the deadly chemical. A game of chance, if you will. Because there was a miscalculation on my part, but there's two of you. Surely you knew this would happen. Oh, you unseemly child. A good head on your shoulders is all you have going. I was going to modern monitor you, uh, but just as Zack says, you're so dull. Then my wife and went out, what am I going to do now? I guess I can go back outside. Are those trees? Uh, are those trees? Oh, look at the birds. Oh, nature is just so disgustingly... I'm going back inside. What is going on over there? <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> so dull. Hmm. Well, that's enough boring chit-chat. Since there's two of you, I'll make a special tweak to the rules. Swapping the syringe... Swapping the syringes is allowed. It was a meme, sorry. Ah, okay. <laughs> I was just imagining, like... 
<laughs> you going outside and be like, nope. Uh. Plus, one of you can inject both of them. However, make sure to inject it to the last drop. There will be hell to pay for any shenanigans. You'll never see the light of day again. And on that note, my lovely sinners, I wish you the best of luck. Suck. Hey, bring me the syringe. Quiet syringe. Here it is. Oh. Hey, do you know which one is lethal? Uh, I thought so. I have no clue either. What's the plan? It'll be a cold day in hell before I die in a shithole like this. That woman can suck it. Alright. Want me to inject both of them? What? Do you really think you'd wake up again after that? We'll find out. Or do you want to give it a shot? Me? Hell no. Anyway. We don't know which is drugged. So... It would be better to know which one of us will be affected. If you don't, then I'll do it. There's no telling what's gonna happen now. Not sure. What happens if you kill over and die? What happens? I mean, if you or me die, what the fuck are we gonna do? What you swore won't come true, but... That... I don't know. I'm sorry, I don't know. Oh, that's right. You have a death wish. Sorry I asked something so dumb. Dumb? That bitch is right. You and I are both play- are both play things. Well, I don't get the whole swearing to God thing, but as long as you die, you're happy, right? So tell me something. Is that vacant look on your face because you've surrendered yourself to death? This sucks hard. I mean, played by life of stall. Even so, I'm not gonna play into that bitch's hands. Get the hell out of here, it's my top priority. So... I'll do as you say. Huh? And give me that. Wait, that's my syringe. Shut up. If you're gonna bitch about it, do it after taking care of yourself. But... This chemical looks dangerous, but it's not poison, right? If it kills me, it means you'll die soon after. In that case, it would be better for me to inject it. Wait. No more waiting. It opened. Hey, let's get a move on. Ah, shit. My head won't stop spinning. I'm seeing stars.
Ah, uh, that makes sense. That's what I should do. Zach? Zach, are you okay? What's wrong? I'm fucking fiending to kill! I'm gonna go crazy! I see. Do as you like. Ah, that's right. I forgot about you. But... Are you okay with that? Huh? You haven't made it outside yet. Besides... My face still has that vacant stare, doesn't it? Are you threatening me after all this time? Huh? No. You swore to God that you would do this for me. And so this this oath of this oath is yours as well. Now I'm not ordering you or asking a favor of you. I'm just asking. Is that okay with you, Zach? Man, you're dumb. Even a lifeless bore of a girl like you is a hand for me to resist killing right now. I mean, if I was able to resist, then this wouldn't be happening to me now. But even I hate lies. Catch my drift? Yeah. Good girl. Please. For now, don't die. When you're done playing, search it up. Oh, hold on. When you're done playing, search it up. If uh, you know what I mean when I say this guy, I'm going back inside. All right. I can't let that kill me right now. I gotta get away. This was not the right way. I I got stuck in the wall. Alright, you know what? While I... I... Disgusting. I'm going back inside. Uh... Wait, I don't... Oh wait, there it is. It's just disgusting. I'm going back inside. Let's. Are those trees? Oh, look at the birds. Ah, nature. It's just so. Disgusting, I'm going back inside. <laughs> uh, she's just like me, for real, for real. Alright. <laughs> okay. Cool. You know, like that kill me right now? I've got to get away. <laughs> All right. Oh shit, shut up. No, no, okay. All right. Load game. Uh, uh I, I can't reach out right now. Oh shit. No, no you don't. Oh, I thought it was a dead end. Uh, I'm getting killed by the game. Yeah. Oh no, a dead end.
Hello, glad you made it this far. Sorry to interrupt, just when things were getting good. After all, this room is for execution by gun- uh, for execution by gunfire. I thought I might as well shoot you. Take a look, see all the guns around you? Each of these are fired with just a push of a little old button. Isn't that lovely? By the way, your falling out with each other was absolutely hilarious. Especially you, Zack. What an exemplary and perfect specimen of a sinner you are. The way that even your struggle in the end, you can't fight your maniacal tendencies, is just so lovely. Shut up. Zack. Stay away from me or you're dead. There, there. The bullets in your body has restored some of your rationality. But look at you. You can't resist. Huh? Hey, Rachel Gardner. Here you go! As long as you have that... Uh, you should both be... Even Steven, right? Even Steven, what the fuck? Now, let's have a duel to the death. Whoever survives gets a more lovely death. What is the point of doing something like that? Silence, you boring rat. Why seek meaning? What do you think that... What do you think that will get you? There's no way that would ever amount to anything for a sinner. That's precisely why there's no need to seek meaning. Okay, now put on an entertaining show. Doesn't even have any bullets yet. <laughs> it won't fire. And the show's over. I wanted to see what it what it what it would what it would uh do. You think I just hand over a loaded gun to some sinners? Sinners trying to commit more sin? That'll get you in instant execution. <laughs> Duh. That was fun. I just wanted to see what happens. Alright. Don't. Could it be that you're scared to pull the trigger? Can you not break away from that... Insipid, boring child? If you're gonna do it, make it quick. Even if you don't shoot, I can't resist killing you. I won't do it. I see. I'm fiending to kill. I'm sorry, making you kill someone as boring as me. Yeah, you're right. It'll probably make me feel shitty. Didn't I tell you that if you're... I didn't I tell you that if you're gonna shoot, then do it. In this range, you won't miss. I won't shoot you. 
<laughs> don't you think that don't you know what'll happen to you oh that's right you've got a death wish i do but this isn't right this is what is in my head this is what is in my heart Zack can kill me but that woman I will not be a puppet for that woman. I won't. I mean both you and I. Are not her playthings. Killing and being killed are both our de decisions to make. After all this time, now you finally said something worthwhile. <laughs> Gah, I can't hold back any longer. Hey, could you at least smile? Do it now. Man, you suck. That dead look in your eyes. But yeah. If that was genuine, then I'd love it. Just imagine that I'm killing you. That puts a smile. Just imagining that I'm killing you puts a smile on my face. So much that I could even kill it myself. Zack. Ah. Oh, wait. Ah. Absolutely horrifying. I take that back. You are not exemplary. Rachel Gardner is half baked is a half baked sinner. To think that Isaac Foster is a suicidal fool ruled by desire. Oh, it saddens me so. Yeah. This re this revelation will cast rain on my condemning parade. Rachel, if you were more dull, I'd die. Well. You got killed? Yep. Yeah. I don't recall you being in charge of uh, deciding that. I can get no joy for punishing you. Oh, it torments me, Rachel. If it comes to this, then Zack would be better. And that would have looked so good riddled with bullets, too. If you can't pull the trigger, then you're nothing but a half-baked sinner. So, why were you able to make it here? Oh well, it's rather boring. We all have to be riddled with bullets. Well, I'm the only one watching your stream? Yep, it's a pretty common occur occurrence. It's nothing unusual here. <laughs> here, there's either one person or there's none. If there's two people or more, that's the unusual part. Uh. Oh my, you lived through that? <laughs> this can't be. You really are a monster that doesn't disappoint. How lovely. Will you kill Zack? Of course. I mean, I'm the only one who can punish such a lovely sinner, right? Stop it. Oh, go ahead and shoot. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but that gun was never loaded from the very start. Well, it's not like it matters. A half-baked sinner like you can never shoot in the first place. But I have to admit that I admire your spunk to turn on- to turn the gun on me. Bang. Alright, might as well punish him since uh, his life's been prolonged and he's in prime form.
now. I won't let you kill him. Zack is meant to kill me. Where did you get that handgun? Bang. No! Where'd you get that gun? You... you slut! So this is your sinful true self. <laughs> That's great. You sinful girl. I'll punish you. I'll punish you. I'll punish the demon lurking underneath that collected face of yours. <laughs> Shove it. Huh? Stupid sadistic bitch. You've been shot so don't look happy. Don't look so happy. Thanks to you I wanna kill. Kill. And kill. I'm mopping at him. You're kidding right? This is reality. Wake up. But, he passed right out. Tuck. Oh. A red handgun. It isn't loaded. Her arm and abdomen have been slashed. Tuck, are you alright? My stomach hurts like hell, duh. Zach, earlier, did you take joy in stitching your own stomach? In, in slicing your own stomach, not stitching. Huh? Don't get me confused with a sadistic bitch. I think you mean masochistic, but okay. I figured it would be better than killing your boring ass and being killed by that bitch of a jailer. Did you see her face? Yeah. That was gold! <laughs> you did me proud too. I feel like a new man. Really? I got a bit of a flesh wound on my stomach, but it's nothing. Alright, let's get going. Are you alright? Oh? <laughs> this ain't nothing. Okay. But know your limits. Put a cork in it. Worry about yourself. A plethora of, bun of buttons uh, lined the device. It appears to be used for this floor. The door is locked. You shitting me? What an annoying bitch. Yeah. So what's the plan? I'm not sure, but the door might open if we operate the machine here. Plethora of buttons lined the device that appears to be used for this floor. Sur surveillance videos of each room, a video delivery system, a trap activation system. There it is, the door, re the door release button. I'm surprised that bitch was able to pull the strings from back here so well. There's also an elevator passage button. I'll go ahead and open it too. Oh, open it, open it. It should open now. Alright, we did it. Yahoo, let's go. Hmm, where does this go? Beats me. What the? This place seems familiar. It's the first that yeah, it's the first area we, we passed through. What? Don't tell me that cocky bitch been around. Don't tell me this cocky bitch been around here right under our nose the whole time. Well, it doesn't really matter. She's warm food. 
Hmm, I'm pretty sure this place had another unopened door. I think it's for the elevator passage. Nice. What are we waiting for? What are we waiting around here for? Let's blow this popsicle stand. I think it was this one. Door is unlocked, yes. Uh, to God give thy name, and thou shalt be admired. Th shalt be admitted entrance. If thou art free from deceit, offer the name which resides within thee. And then know thyself. Know this. God values not the corrupt. Hey, how long are you going to be reading that for? Is something interesting written down there? Um, not especially. Huh? Well, why are you so serious while well, you read it? I'm sorry. Don't worry about it. Let's go. Is that the end of the game? It's the end of this episode. Of episode 2. There's 4 episodes in total. So, we're halfway done. The elevator door is shut. It won't come open. We come all this way and this? Hey. Think it'll open with that button. Uh, with that button riddled machine from earlier. I'm pretty sure there wasn't an elevator boot switch. Even on the control machine. Let me think. Oh, I'll, uh, I'll let you do the, I'll, I'll let you do the thinking for the both of us. Uh, what's this? There's an, uh, indentation in the wall. This indentation. Come to think of it, the words bid thy name were written on the wall we saw earlier. Bid thy name. I'm pretty sure we have something with our names written on them. The... These. By thy nameth to God. There are names written on these two placards. Plus, they've probably... They've probably the perfect size to fit in the small indentation. But there are two placards. One for me and one for Zach. Not the sinners, so Rachel. Nope, it's not this one. Okay. It was Zach. Okay. Okay, this one. It should have worked. Hey. Don't you have one left over that way? It's a leftover. I'll throw this one away. You sure about that? Yeah. It doesn't look necessary. Isaac Foster's name uh, placard is embedded in the wall. Oh, it opened. We're getting on. Wait. Hey, Ray. You did a hell of a job back there. What do you mean? I mean, you did a, a hell of a job shooting that crazy bitch. Feels like a steamroller has been lifted off my shoulders. Yeah. Hey, Ray. So... What brought you here in the first place? Oh. I witnessed a murder and came here for counseling. When I awoke, I was on the lowest floor of this building. Huh? That makes no sense. Tell me about it. Oh, and the gun you fired. It wasn't that bitch. It wasn't that bitches, was it? What's the story on that? We, I'm 
Going to space by the elevator. Yep. We're in space. This is my gun. Why did you get your hands on something like that? Inside my handbag, wrapped in a handkerchief. I've had it ever since I witnessed a murder. Then, why didn't you just use it in the beginning? I will not kill myself. God will not forgive me. No, I didn't mean just that. Besides, you're the one who will kill me. I'm not sure if you're an idiot or smart. At any rate, uh, what you did back there, shooting that bitch, was the right thing. It makes me laugh just thinking about it. The timing was absolutely perfect. You're in a good mood. You could say that. You too, right? Yeah. We're here. It's not good. Suck. Can you play Tattletail, please? Tattletail. Uh, not sure if I have the game. I'll I'll check. Might as well at this point. To be continued. All right, let me see. Is it on Steam? Wait, actually, no. I should probably play. Hold on. Okay, um...